And Tessus already looking to make some space towards Monta, running in anti-flash. There's a lot of CTs there to receive them. They're practically all five here, and they were ready. Nico does draw first blood, though, and they've already got a goosh. Oh, God, look at the flurry of frags. Electronic and Perfecto. Going to try and stabilize just a little. Of okay. course. Here's Heroic, ladies okay. and gentlemen. Here's, this is how they work. <laughs> Fakey boys. Fakey, Fakey boys. boys. They uh, rush. Whatever. Oh, <laughs> we lost it. I was going to try and take the song somewhere else, but you're right there, Alex. You were bang on. Look how much space Cadian's taken. There's the footsteps. And they're going to rotate out and then back towards oh, the B-bomb site. The bomb goes. Mm. Funny that. I like that. like that a whole lot. And if you can oh. stay alive, do a bit of damage, even better. But yeah, now you know. You're like, wait, wait I, don't, I don't hear it. I don't... Oh, dearie me. Right, round we go. Electronics off. No kid, of course. Now that extra time coming back in. He doesn't know if they've pushed up lower towards graffiti, towards CT. They could be anywhere, but we know where they are. One's on short. And old Borup's going for a bit of a walk around. So Electronics still dangerous as ever, but the time is a massive factor now. And there it goes. So nicely done by Heroic, even in the first round, showing that little bit of style we love to see. The drop down. And Nico's taking full control. Look at this, simple as you like. One, two, three, mm. four headshots galore. Yeah, you can see the util being put out by those B players. Smoke towards Monster, Flash towards Short. It's all there. I think Boomage is starting to come around, though. Did they see that second player? I think they did. Electronic still stands. It's incredibly impressive he did this much, but now support's on the way. Yeah, rotates in. Simple about to be naded down to 25. That one hurt to plant in the smokes down with just a couple of seconds to spare. Does get it in, flashing, fragged, simple. Executes Borup, more to be needed from Stown, but unfortunately unable to deliver. Cadian, four players, all hoping to find him. And he calls the bluff on the fake. Simple, spotted, needs to check it. And now the spray's just not quite there. It's Perfecto on the 10 second to fuse and does eventually pull it across the line. So they're clearing this out, making sure Electronic hasn't stuck around. Yep. Punished. Boomich finds it. Very hard to find a way back in now with 30 seconds left. You just got to give it your best shot. Kadian is going to line up the smoke. It will achieve very little in the grand scheme of things because it's so clearly coming towards this site. Simple flash though. That buys them some room. Now flanking perhaps. Tess is caught with an aid in his hand. Simple wants to stop everything here. Pushing through. Oh, Borup Borup. does line up too. He's only got six seconds though, and unfortunately, no time to plant, no time to frag. Like, and I'll kill him after the time. killing him after the time. That is brilliant. Oh. It's rare to see a player hold his nerve and hold his trigger like that. Deagle's out. Clock. And flashes. Acadian. This should be a, a swift one. Oof. Catch that, it's down. Oh, God, the timing couldn't have been worse. Nico finds Perfecto, puts Flamey into a bit of bother, but. It should stabilize. There it is. Stability through simple. Lovely stuff. All right, simple as you like here. We'll just be Katie and last man standing. And OG, single digit games. Katie and making sure he keeps this one costly, but Boomich takes him on down, and that's round three posted on the board. Oh, this is what I was talking about in the pre-show with Boomich taking space. Normally it's over towards the B side of things, but with all of this stolen over towards A, if he plays to contain and locks down this rotation from Heroic, Navi could be onto something here. Look how passive Perfecto is playing on the barrel's position, and now Boomich does take down the boost. Oh. <laughs> oh, gets warned off, but three on four, 35 seconds. This is the hit. Smokes are blooming for both sides. Perfecto catching a good deal of nade damage, but Kadian catches there he is again. more from Boomich. He's just the spanner stopping this machine from functioning correctly. Clean onto another. Nico on yeah. for the ace. Wow. He's very sharp, is Nico, but. Flash comes in. They try and play off the back. Electronic unfazed and unmoved. Symbol's got his back, so you can stay pretty firm in your beliefs. As already Nico's fallen foul to it, and Electronic hasn't fully shown the intentions here, which I like. Still plenty to be played for and room to be controlled. Timing could not have been better. Just as Cadian switched to his util. Another round looking to be converted. It's down trying to rock the boat. Bombs on its way towards eight. Oh, that smoke coming down right now is going to buy them Timing. until roughly 16, 17 seconds. They have to go through this. They have to make something of it. Perfecto. All but over.
over now. Shut down as soon as that smoke went up. You saw the odds just teetering over in a team ace. Every single player getting one kill on the opposition. Not a util. Bits in the right corner. Looking for his first frag, and he does catch Borup with the spray. First down. That was the low HP player, though. There's more to come. Tess is just on the edge of that smoke. Simple hasn't moved a muscle, evades the flash, can contest the plant. Oh. And he does have the angle just into the shoulder. Boomage catching another as it fades. Bombs yet to be planted. They've got 15 seconds. They need frags and they need a plan now. Stown's got one. But that's all. And Na'Vi weather the storm of their first CT round with the standard. Lovely start. And they're using all of their utility to continue to buy time. And there is absolutely no flank to be concerned about. Perfecto's confirmed that. Nico is going to have to give it a go. Off the flash. In he goes. Finds himself a simple. Maybe a flamey as well. Oh! Goodness, that's the low HP player there. There's still a chance here. If Nico oh, no. gets another, they're going to throw this round away. Nico gets himself the fourth, and a round becomes reality after one more frag. Nico has turned this completely upside down. Topsy turvy. Nico doesn't move. The bait shots from Perfecto still not working out. Nico winning the round by now moving a muscle. And now he swings in. Perfect to adjust Bacadian trades. Oh. And that was supposed to be the 10th. Nico disagrees. Smoke and flamey's hands. Will he deploy it? It's gone on out now. That'll corral them to the right side of the pillar. Flashes through. And Flamey's safe pair of hands has grabbed one. Yeah, failed flash from Heroic. Don't think they can contest that plant, though. Perfecto hoping that his bullets would have done enough. If anything, it signs his death like Warren. Simple into the sight, though. Cadian. Thrust into a one versus three and a missed shot gobbles up the flashbang. He's running out of chances. It will be Simple's responsibility to defuse and he's holding it this time. So Cadian, just a matter of time and eventually eliminated. A 10-5 half and it feels like we just had a long one, but I promise this one should be a little quicker. We get underway. Flamey ready to take some fight. Bow up and Tessa's pushing forward. Flamey standing tall. That's information. The door swings open. Electronic tries to trade, but Cadian with the boost. The trap was set and Heroica punished them. Yeah, that's... Fantastic start. Oh, door closed, though. They're boosting to find them, but Borup's ready. They even want to go again. This is a clean pistol round from Heroic and a necessary one at that. And unfortunately for them, I think the pistol round in the second half is probably done and dusted. I haven't had that one in a while. Done and dusted? Done and dusted. Classic. <laughs> Uh, perfecto, try to make it look good, but it will be shut down. Heroic with a nice initial gambit there. Now, Borup is advancing with Stown, and Flamey no longer exists. Uh, this, unfortunately for Simple, would have been the end if he hadn't have hit two okay. spectacular Deagle shots. A is open, Borup's rotating, Perfecto's got the rotate locked in. Stown fanning around with a door is not going to get him far. And now, oh, Perfecto can continue to tuck in. So, poor old Borup dealt a bit of dud hand. They know where one of the two is, and they've got a pretty sneaking suspicion as to the other. Simple looking to single-handedly win this round with a $700 sidearm. I said, must be nice to have another the world's one. best. Must be damn nice. Four kills with just a deagle and armor. In those different countries. Yeah, just a little Doesn't bit. Doesn't it? Every, Every time. visit. Every time. Simple left a mark on this round. He did. And that was the fourth. Oh, oh jumping. Damn. See your bow wrap. No one checking on him at this point. No one doing much. 20 seconds. He's got a chance here. Pulls the trigger. Reveals it. Simple wants to knock the perch off oh. his head. And he does take the first turret down. Cadian does well to find one propelled forwards. And the spray for one for Nico as well. Back and forth. The trades favor Na'Vi. Five seconds. A single second to spare. The wallbang doesn't come out. He is low. It's down using the elevation of the bin. Simple left I'm in a one. 1v1. Simple's looking the wrong way. Smoke deployed. An AK picked up. What's he looking for? A kit? Nothing. <laughs> from Simple. He just pushed the smoke. Oh, they've gone for the all-in. So it's SMGs galore. Electronic forward. And we'll get taken down by the MP9. Simple tagged on up as well. Low HP. Can he stand and deliver any more? He's got the bomb, Chad. This is terrifying. Flanking. This is terrifying. He needs help. And he gets oh. a no-scope onto Stown. Boomer just trying to support him. Bomb lost. Orp grabbed. Borup tagged. He's throwing out his smoke to try and escape. They know the bomb was lost knife in kill. playground. A knife kill from oh. Tessus in the meantime. Now the bomb is back under Na'Vi control. Boomer will recover that. 
and a 2v2. This mid round is about to get chaotic. Uppity over we go. Ooh, the desired AK as well. Gorgeous. Perfecto will be the one to receive. Umich can't stop the bomb from that angle. So he's going to be the one to first take contact, you'd assume. There's one. And that's enough. Perfectly played. Perfectly played. Really enjoying this from Na'Vi. It does seem like they've woken up on the right side of the bed this morning. 15 to 6. All right, well, Nessus with the knife has been able to get the org up again. Let's see if he can get anything more. Oh, he tagged Electronic there. He got that on the way down. That's mad. Well, Tessus is gone. Not having a great map here today, unfortunately. Having a nice day, maybe. As this one's done. Yup. Stick a fork in this one. So, as you can see, it will be Borup to take a little jiggle. The simple will yeah. flick. Oh, you, you, oh, nearly. Gets it, though. Okay, so, then we should Nico see Nico kill simple, simple. Precisely. <laughs> An electronic just didn't get the memo. 16 to 6. Another fantastic performance. Usually on their yard position, and Cadian's tucked in to hold for the info. Just Simple jumping across for now, and he's anticipating the Boomich drop. He was right to do so. Simple, a real demon on the P250. And Na'Vi have got clear intentions here. Four of them in yard. Ooh. Ooh. Intentions or not, sometimes the outcome differs, and so far it does. Cadian making some decent work of them, but it's Stown who could be the bigger threat playing from the old locker room. Simple having to peel away slightly. As the P250 still stand, this man with the P250 strikes fear into many hearts. Flamey trying to draw some attention over towards the lobby. And there you go. <laughs> Dink dead. Borup hits the deck, and now we find oh. ourselves in a 2v3. Yeah, and Stan's tucking into the heart. He hears the access, and Simple is oh. having an absolute Get him out one. of here. Sends them packing. Tessas, he's got his suitcase half packed. He's got his stickers. Spotty. Ooh. What do you call that? A tarpaulin? A bindle. That's bindle, what I needed to is. hear. Thank you. Words oh. are hard. Oh, Dumit just walked straight past. Yeah. Molly missed as well towards the target. Oh, I'm wrong. What's going on here? This is such a messy, messy round. And I saw rifles for the T's and SMGs ish falling over, but it's the scout to almost close the account as electronic. Left in a 1v4, and these don't even look that... that Electronic? What's the plan, my friend? The plan is get a couple of kills when it's dark. Getting a bit nervous. He thought CT Vent was the issue, but it's down to find it in the end. Double kill, make it triple now. And Bar up and Nico, they're pushing forward again. Well, curiosity could certainly kill here. That's eight bullets remaining. Electronic only needed a couple. And Nico tries lobby. to... Lobby. Oh, I, I don't like this aggressive play. Oh. The Tech Nines love it. This is their absolute environment. But Tessus and Cadian are in, a, I guess, a spot to do something. Yeah, Electronic's going to tuck in. He spots one. Cadian pushing and loses his head. Back and forth, the Force by Wars. I can't believe Navi have made this one look so comfortable. Electronic takes it to a conversion. Stown all the way with that AK. He's just going to try and keep hold of his weapon at this point, and they are starting to push him audibly hunting him down. Electronic up, hoping to bait him in. It's a nice wide swing from Perfecto. He'll take the AK back and wow. See how many he gets. None. Perfecto, quicker on the trigger. Tessus goes down, but look how many players waiting. He drops down, peeks his head over the top. Probably gonna die. Flash is coming 15. as well. We're, we're running all on time. They're all going oh. from this way. Cadian's found one. Perfecto. Bomb. Quick work. Uh. Ten seconds. Where is the bomb? Can't even win it. Just we live. Need to kill him now. Just live. Yeah, exactly. The round is is over. Oh Christ. As long as he don't get doesn't go down after time, Stan can push in and take this away. This is gonna hurt the cash. Down oh. as well with the real punish. Two two. Back and forth we go. Cadian might be flashing Nico forward off this. He wants to go through it. And he does catch a perfectly flash perfecto, oh. but he doesn't convert. That's a bit of a mare. Early frag found. Two members of Na'Vi very low, but they are descending with that bomb. Haven't seen a lower side. A hit, really. First time we're going to get some action here on B. Tessis and Cadian rotating in. UMP, certainly not the weapon for the job. He hasn't got time to elevate, so he will just opt for this lower side. Boomich playing with the doors. Plays with Tessis and... The end of him, Stown claws one back for Heroic. It is that orb that 
sees no action whatsoever. Electronic makes short work of him. Perfecto with no HP. This is an ambitious fight to try and take with an armored AK. He wants that weapon. He nades itself to it. <laughs> and now it would be lovely if he was to get the frag with the uh, naded Galil. And he does. But that should be about it. Simple. And 3-3. Three, three. Oh, wow, spam. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. He gets it. And his test has tested. Now the bomb can go lower. Stown's been there the whole time. I will remind you. What's they got? A molly, two mollies. Surely they don't just go for the full hold. That's just easy stown Risky. frag any day of the week. Yeah, the bomb's loose. Simple has to clutch up. 35 seconds as he swings open the door and stout's already waiting for him. Faded it and returned his aim necessary very quickly. Four on, maybe five on two. Boomich the first to draw blood for Na'Vi. They know Nico's tucked in. That's not the weapon for the job, Borup, and he's given him a way in. Nico trapped towards the garage. Simple wants him. Yeah, Kaden can't really support him because he has to worry about Nini. And now he's gone down. It's a two on two. They've got so much time. 30 seconds. Tess is in the vents. Boomich anticipates it. Smoke to cover him off. And Kaden needs one hit. Oh, and the jumping from Boomich has done enough. But it is through the smoke that Tess thrives. Five to five. Weapon and position. <gasps> Stan's been caught. Not down yet, but does well to maneuver into the headshot. Boomich goes down the vents, though. Tessus. Does find himself oh. the first two. Really is just textbook counter-strike here. Perfecto eventually not, knocks him off his roost. Doors are closed. Vents are dropped. Perfecto wants to plant, but uh, it's the timing of that door opening. Really has worked out wonderfully, and he closes it. Oh, they're just toying with him now. Poor old Boomage. Stares at the flash. Fake required, or is he just going to hold it? Kadian to sweep in. And so, seven to five, you said 10-5 possible, Chad, and now with, what, four in a row from the CT? With, unless they make this one costly, money shouldn't be too much of a drama. It's two. Oh, isn't it nice? Very nice. And none of those threats we were considering have really come to anything. That's nice from Flamey. That's very nice from Flamey, but that bomb... Excuse me? Is Flamey just, just, just putting some style points Staunching on this? Staunching on him right now. Yeah, I like this. Come on, Flamey, have a crack at it. Why not? Control room to the left would be the first target. He gets that cleanly, then it's game on. Probably not going to happen, though, <laughs> and it doesn't. It's down. That's a little uh, feature for you. I know you like that one, Chad. Uh, Didn't bring it up, but then you went and flamed my game. So flamey. Ooh. Out in the corner. Down the vents we go. Oh, this is awkward moments. The CTs are just walking into them backwards. <laughs> the shotgun is so scary. <laughs> Doom, doom. Well, Electronic has stayed alive. Perfecto has taken down Stown. Now it's just Bar up and Kadian. This could be the seventh on the ball for Navi. Could. Kadian's got the bomb, though. Perfecto could get caught here by Bar up swing. Dink exchanged. Electronic finishes him off. So now it gets awkward. Now it gets difficult. Kadian, I've seen you pull these kind of rounds out of your hat. <laughs> Let's see if what type of hat's he wearing, Alex? Oh, it's a, it's a snap back. It's backwards. It's really cool. 8-7. We're going to go discuss our favorite hats. Skull King. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very nice. Here There's we go. Flash. Here we go. Simple. Sweet Jesus. It's gone. Okay. That's a, a lot of money squandered there. That's a full Kevlar vest and a CZ-75. $1,200 gone in a bullet. And good damage inflicted Great by damage. Boomage. Really nice. But there's only three of them left. They still haven't planted. Borup has the bomb. Nico trying to challenge as well. Flamey oh, dealing with the Where are they going? Ecto's caught Nico. If they find Flamey, they want to pivot. He knows that. And he has been found out. They are just running around now as a partner or a pair. Oh, good shot from Boomich again. He's definitely not willing to bow down to this one. He may have. This could be so nice. He if he checks back in. Hi. Oh, he's seen both of them. That's a lovely bit of info. Smart gamer. Bomb's going down, though. He actually fakes the drop-off again. Tessus is going to ignore it. He dropped as well. Look <laughs> at this. Jesus. <laughs> oh, well. It is on to Tessus to clutch now. He's got three frags already no in kit. this pistol. No kit on Perfecto. So Tessus is going to jump for the info. Does get him off the bomb. Oh, Confirms yeah. it with his jump peaks. These guys are all just playing count. Oh. Counter-Strike at such a level. And it will be the magnificent pistol round from Tessus, all things considered.
Nobody's watching Heaven just yet, so this might... Oh, Boomish, you saw him! Does now get the frag, and it looks like Electronics wrapped this wall on it, put a bow on it, and simple. Oh, losing his orb! Perhaps even losing his round. There's still 30 seconds. Perfecto and Boomich left to try and pick the pieces oh, the up. A dink straight through the vents <laughs> and he's gone. He's out of there. Orb recovery could oh. be difficult. He went flew past it. Yeah. Perfecto got it. We'll play nicely. SMG out. Already on lower and no one's home. Famuses, yeah, this is... They're, they're, they're free and clear. Oh, Orb's loving yeah. it. Can chill where he is. Molly's in. Cadian's on the flank. Oh, freebie. Gorgeous. Now Perfecto's even in question now. He's <laughs> got two. That's you can't ask for any more. Yeah. What are you meant to do with these two now? Nothing. Save. All right, Heroica looking geared to take this map. So good stuff from them to bounce back after overpass. Now all the pressure on Simple to hold on to the AWP. If he can't carry this, if he can't maintain his grip, and Tessa says no. 11 kills. Maybe there was a moment, of a glimmer of hope last round with that Deagle, but then it faded away, and that's what it's felt like this entire time. Bit of a fade away, but simple. Gonna bring something back. Maybe spark something among this Na'Vi size. It just seems dreary. Molly comes in, here comes the hit. Good trade comes out, even if Electronic falls. Boomich is on it with Perfecto. Simple here, and everything's gone to plan. Shut down, move on, four stand for the CTs. 13 to 9. I can't get rid of him. Still here. Fire, flames, everything poured in. Still stands finally gone. But oh. Nico coming in in combination. That's big. But Simple, he's going through the smoke. He's, he's oh. stopping. Simple just walking in. He's still operating. He's still trying this one out. Good God, that was close. Oh my word. Why is he always a bloody danger? But Borup's found flamey. So it's just Simple. And Simple, sadly, for once, isn't enough. Okay. Back in we go. Ooh, cross. they already cross. Pure confidence, it feels like. They've got Na'Vi by the throat now. Oh, it, it's start of the round, we're barely 30 seconds in and, and Heroica are everywhere. Perfecto surrounded on all fronts. He's got nothing to do but die. This is 15 every day of the week. What a T side this has been. Five, six, seven rounds now for the T side for a third map here. Na'Vi unable to convert their map pick. It's always been a weird one with Na'Vi in terms of the map they pick, Chad. It's like Dust 2 for a while and like no one can really pick Dust 2 and they're going for Nuke and clearly it's certainly not like, you know... It's gonna have to be something special. It is certainly gonna have to be at least two. Wow, that's three. Flamey, he's not going quietly into the night. He wants to fight against himself. Three very crucial frags in order to keep and extend this not. Na'Vi Nuke equipped with something better than a Desert Eagle by the end of this. Boomich has fallen. Electronic likely trading. And there we have it. So it will be three rifles and AWP in fact preserved. Electronic grabs himself the AK-47. Fain control towards the lower and then Kadian with the Molly and two flashes might just be a top piece. Perfecto can't get blind here. There we go. Turns it. One, two, three. Three. Maybe even four. I can count. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. Ooh. You don't see this flank all too often, do you? Not at this pace. Not at the pace at one minute. Still on the clock. Look at this. He's turning his... He's going to have two backs turned. Maybe even four. Hi, everyone. Oh, it's everything you've ever wanted. It does die to squeaky, but... you. That's that's everything lining up. It it's becomes possible. It's still doable right now for Heroic. They're going to get down the vent. Boomich. He was there. He's oh. been there the whole time. Excellent play from Boomich. And honestly, that flank here, the timing was unreal. I need to see something to make me believe this round has got any sort of threat to it. That flash isn't bad. It's a good stepping stone, isn't it? But everyone's here. Simple's down the ramp. We've got Flamey on the, oh. on the board. It's quick. They, they're having none of it. We're one away from 15-15. OT is feeling like it could be on the cards here. Heard lots of footsteps. This is getting very dicey. Simple's back in time. He is. He's flashed off for now, but it's Flamey that needs something. Nor Simple does pull the trigger. Four on four as they Which drop to the lower side. Boomich is there in time. Electronic could be caught out here. <gasps> And in the meantime, it's Boomich. Spots both of them. Gets Damage. one. Good damage inflicted into Tessus. Kadeen catches Simple outside. Bomb to be planted thanks to Tessus. Goodness, if Tessus was to plant here, if he makes a sound, if he confirms that the 
Bomb is on that lower side. Oh, good oh. shot. Electronic, the robot. Oh, and Borup's gone too. We're looking like overtime. Tessus, he is on that lower side. Perfecto towards Decon. 30 seconds. He wants to fight. And that's the sound cue they needed. Navi. Do. You overhydrate them. Yeah, I do. It's a real problem. Oh, this could be a problem for Heroic. Simple, though, pushing up. Kadian is on the way. Oh, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh, God, there's no escape. Put out his misery by Nico, and then Ele Electron is gone. This is an absolute travesty of a start for Na'Vi, being tried to kept together by Boomich and Perfecto. But the pace from Heroic. God damn. So that's the first round Heroic have posted in the last seven. Oh, he's in trouble. Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble. Safe from the flash. Double flash. He's going to surely go down here. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> what? They were lined up for simply plugs them both from the air. A double peek. Oh, oh and a fast flick. Simple's furious. Nico's going to go down as well. He's on for the ace. Simple. Absolute disrespect. Slapping down a collateral. Four. An ace is the only accepted form of currency here if he wants a round win. Bit of a tag to begin with. That's going to be a second. Uh -oh, they go one by low. one. It all becomes a little bit more possible. Not like this. This would be the perfect microcosm of Na'Vi. Simple's got four. Four up to clutch. But Perfecto saves us. Let's see who's going to take the lead. Simple's double. Flamey. Very lucky. Mid-air. Very lucky. He was supposed to be screwed. I don't know how he hits that. <laughs> Still no, sh not really sure about that one. Uh, but yeah, Kadian. Kadian on one. Bore up on the other. And see Kadian trained on this, chooses to go towards Simple. Probably the right choice, I'd say, at this point. But Perfecto going to manage some good work here. Electric's yep. going to play it back in. He's oh. spotted out. That's great work. Perfecto now almost running low on time. Kadian's just buying it. Seconds now pass as he knows his chances have dwindled on this. But he has to go for it no matter what. There's the first and the second. Hold it. No Drop time. the flash. Do something. Oh, OK. That's the end of that. 17 to 16. It is going to be an advantage heroic. Electronic's going to be forced out into a flashbang here. They've got all the right util. God, the headshots come through thick and fast. Oh, one way. Down. One here way. we go. Boomage can only do so much, but he has to do it all for them. It's not, not planned planned for him. For him. Not oh planned my God. For him. No. Run, he can't do anything about it. It's all over and tragedy strikes. Flamey going to play by door. This could be down towards He's getting some potentially. Space. He's got rim on this. Spotted by Bore up and loses to Bore up. That's the vent rotation possible now. So now be 25 CTs. seconds. Look how set up they are. Oh, there's no time, Alex. This should be a slaughter. Oh. And now just simple. Pop flash. Looking good. Simple. Not going to go down without a fight. But he is going down. 19 to 16. Heroic take nuke. And we'll be getting ourselves ready for trade. I mean, we could always just get rushed to cast around later on, you know. Oh. oh hello. Rush, you on the other end, or you, you're just prank calling us? I, I just uh, received a call from the high ups, and I was told I could not do the knife round. Um, apparently, someone from the desk put in a call. I'm not sure who. I wasn't watching, so I don't know if someone said anything. But, but I don't think they're going down. It looks like Flame is sneaking out. It's only Nico here. He doesn't have a lot of... Well, actually, he has a lot of util, so he could rain a HE down, but he's given up some ground, gets destroyed at the long range. Perfecto now. Probably going to push up as close as he can. Boomage, I doubt he's going to go down, but it, honestly, it looks like they're saving already, and I can't believe that. That's craziness. How does it make you feel? Uh, kind of weird. I don't always use, like, you know, magical library or okay. mythical forest, but I guess production room. <laughs> 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 Looks like he has made it down for now. I do have a good feeling about Stown's position here. He's quite oh, hidden. I'm down. He's hit a great shot. Simple tried to cross with that bomb. It's on the catwalk now. Issues for Na'Vi. Terrible round to lose. Terrible round to lose. Stown's coming from behind them. They're not ready for that. Cadian caught. Oh, for Flamey fixes his issues, but Stown does finish him off. So 1v3. Perfecto yet to frag. Oh, Tessus knows. Good shots. Ooh. And Stown just going hunting. Heard the scope. Didn't want to. Sounds like a bully. Bore up, He always though. said he'd give me his RuneScape gold, and he never did. Never did, did he? I made all these promises. Simple's oh. got a nice prank, though. Okay, this could this could get fun, at least. 
Orbs coming into play everywhere. This is just Orpa's paradise, apparently, as again, this could be another one. Not to beat. Simple now gets the line, but it plays in Bora. The last two for the T's. Uh, the territory's not great. They're going to have to really fight for these frags, and Simple's having a bit of a look. Smoke dissipating. Might give him a chance, but it gives Cadian a better one. As now the 1v4 beckons. Does hit the first. Oh, the push. Oh, Simple God. gets paid out oh. and loses it. Down to $850. Oh, Deep Molotov I'm talking about. Burrup will get flashed in here traditionally, but will be held at bay. And Perfecto, well, he's done. Uh, I'm waiting to see the, the rest of this lovely idea. I mean, maybe Boomish is a little further ahead. Yeah, so he does get to catch out Borup, but this line of defense still holds. Sounds okay. No one threw Ivy. This is... One dimensional, but they are out. There's no other layers to this. So Tess is just into the smoke. He's through it. Simple. Finding the head casually. I don't know how he makes it look so, so easy every single time. It's flamey oh, now. Oh, go on. If he does the jump, I will scream. He's thinking about it. I can tell. I can feel it. No, he wants Tess instead, but he is not going to have accounted for the player behind him. And so it is heroic starting to really pick up steam, if you'll excuse the pun here on train. <laughs> does seem like there's an air of pace here. A fast pop dog drop. Boomich silently dismounts, oh. and that's a really good sequence. Boomich, the in-game leader, leading by example. That's one way to win a round just like that. It's been a while since we saw that kind of flair. Pro can fight for this. They don't have to save with all that money. Make a good point, Chad, but finding ways back in is going to be difficult. The utility could be their avenue. Oh, come on, guys. So. I'm so happy. I just love the reply that someone made is imagine walking around the corner and seeing that. You know, you got your uh, flash, excuse flash me into beach. <laughs> boof, boof, <and> just... <laughs> it's Boomich. He's on the entry fragging duties once again. He's been yeah, perfecto so out. Well. He's got bar up. Here we are. Around the smoke. Tessis has a safe haven, but it's potentially sprayed down. And now just three CTs remain. Sound. Can't save. Cadian, they certainly don't have that Too option. Close. There's a lot of fights. It's down towards the backtracks. Firing off pot shots has yet to connect. Two orbs as well. So if that bomb goes down, we might have to call the save. <laughs> <laughs> as they back away, the realization sets in. That <laughs> once again, we had 30 seconds. <laughs> so add it all together. I reckon I've nearly casted a minute so far. Oh, this is great. The pistol, the force by conversion, and then against the eco of her there on the third. Vote for oh, which yeah. save you enjoyed the most. <laughs> oh, they're going again. Here we go. This time, Molly's galore. The floor is on fire, but Perfecto extinguishes one. Fight back comes in from Tessus. And there's the peak back through. Flamey and Electronic in combination force the fight. But down holds the line this time. Yeah, that's a big frag from Cadian as well. Gives him the numbers advantage, but look at Electronic. He had a chance. He's gone and lost it now. Missed shot from Simple. That's the end of that. And so Heroic will take one, and we actually see a fall. And now let's see this bloody Krieg. Oh, yes, that's what we're talking about, Flamey. Cadian doing well to find two in the instance. Now, no, Nico coming in as the inner player. He is going to catch some flame to buy them time for that bomb retrieval. It's on top of the train, I believe. Nico has a flashbang. He could try the wall bang, but that would kind of give up the jig. He's all right if he gets the timing. No, Electronic goes around. It's an eight, seven, half. Not too shabby for either side, I'd say. Heroic. On top over towards Connector to hold them at bay from Burrup, but it's towards dinner they go. Perfecto to receive and in the back lines. He's going to get pushed on further as the retake setup from Na'Vi is already under fire. Boomich on the quick flank. Might be able to take down Tessus here, but they pushed so far up. Simple will take one. The positions are given on. And the Glocks, they found the right range. Boomich, there's not much he can do. Ooh, Tessus. Oh, gosh, the shots were desperately needed to land. Look at this Nico going slight. I was going to say undetected, but there you go. Position now noted. Electronic going to give away the game, but Borup's right there. No kit on Electronic, so time is of the essence, and Nico going to be drawn in, but mostly to protect and ensure that there's no funny business. Nice work from Heroic to get this one started. Three for Nico then. Actually, maybe there was a step or two. Perfecto could have heard this. Bombs in the site, and they've missed their chance. They're going to get the bomb down, and Stown's even found one. 
Yeah, Nico should be able to keep this one under lock and key now. No issues to arise. It is a position from Simple where, oof, could have caught them off guard, but Nico's wow. reaction speed was very high. So Heroic 10. No ease to this, a tough one at all costs. Flamey choosing to post up on the closed train. Flashes, Molly's all coming in, he's forced out of position. One side ain't covered, Perfecto knows he's in danger. Does well to find Stounders, better on Boar up the third is excellent. Ooh, boy. Suddenly it's all simmered down, Cadian. Uh, they're concaved, they're doorknobs. Okay. And I was a, a dumb little kid and I was on the swing set outside of the chain swing set. And you know how you spin them up the whole way? Down, look at this positioning. He's, has he been spotted? He didn't. He suspects. And he's not gonna know, no. Stown gets caught. Quick scope from Simple. The flank gone. Bomb was supposed to be joining them, but Simple's caught them off guard. I can't believe Stown went for the ladder there. Nothing to get them across, and Simple's gonna get more. How many more? That's the question. Another. Hello, whack a mole. Uh, doesn't make the difference. Spectre with a nice control of his laser beam. So, Stown wants to get across. Currently being held by Flamey, it will come down to timing. Ah, well, he's been spotted, but he gets the frag, so that's gonna sell it. Simple and Perfecto have done great work. Nico catches Perfecto, that should have been Nico surviving, but now it's on to Simple. One on one for now, Boomich is on his way. Stown mantling on the train, trying to find the angle, but Simple holds them back. Na'Vi back in the game. Triple kill from him, Perfecto takes one, the inner hit falls flat. It's gonna be a fantastic opportunity, but yes, 20 seconds. Lauren, you're right to be shouting about the clock. Draw the rotation, Simple's going. Oh, that could be big. I wonder how much they have to work. 15, 15 seconds. seconds. And oh, and they get the frag. Both of them, in fact, Lauren. It is all onto Electronic, and he's gone too. Simple has to save the day. He has got one, but Tessis has the bomb. Surely he can plant. Simple can stop him, but no. It's perfecto. There is no time. He just has to survive. He's dancing on the train. It's 13. Simple gets the necessary shot. Perfecto too. And just about keeps hold of his rifle as well. Chaotic Counter-Strike out there towards the bomb train with the late uh, rounds. Uh, uh. This is ballsy. He's oh, ahead of damn. the molly. He's ahead of everything. And Tessus has opened up the other side of the map as well. Okay, so Stown's coming oh, in around. No. Desperately trying to do something. The smoke from Simple enables the cross. Just pure yeah. chaos this round, isn't it? Oh, bomb train. Bad. What is going on? Right, bomb plant. Calm it down. 2v3. Tessus is so low. Element of Surprise is his biggest weapon. And the flashbacks are too. He gets both of them. Magnificent from Heroic. Now Boomich, he knows there's a player through Whoa. the smoke, but Tessus actually gets all three of them. That was huge. Well, let's see what this man has to offer. Flashed away, re-picks, grabs one, another one close. Down to deal with. And he knows it. So what's his approach? Edging slightly. Sound cues enable him to regain control. Smoke from Stown. Wants to find Flamey, but picking up that orb is a threat. Flamey Kaya can't move a muscle and Stown knows it, trying to hit a very hard shot. This should still be Heroic's round. Remember, Simple's the only weapon that has any potency here, but he's still hitting some shots. Finally knocked off his perch. It's a two on three. It's a two on one, three on one. And he hasn't really got any bullets left. Five in the clip. Tensus brings his health to null. So 13 to 13 as they hit this inner sight. Stown. Look to the left, shot to the right. Perfecto, though, is alone. Did well before, oh. Oh, again. These shots are so crisp, sees another, still staying alive, still getting info, still doing damage. Bomb being loose is gonna have to be picked up and recovered. And it looks like Cadian's on covering duty, but his buddy's been killed. So it's all on him. Cadian, no time at all, but he's got players pushing him down. Likely gonna kill him. I was gonna say after time, but not gonna rush this one. M4, one shot kill without the supplied helmet. All right, so smoke's over again, potential misdirection. Tessus was a hero in one of the previous rounds. Burr up, down, pop. It was against the AK, so the Kevlar didn't matter whatsoever. No, but Nico jumping into Electronics Jaws has really given them quite the leg up. And this is no fun. If you made a call off the T, the T start, losing two players in the first 20 seconds puts Caden on notice. He really wants to try and find the repeak and boomage. Can't believe his luck catching the AWP slipping. Down, jumping into the flames oh. like a lemming. Electronic finding his triple. Tessus really is just scratching his head, having a sip from his have a nice day water beaker. 
coming on through. They definitely know where he is now. The clamp, the oh, vice, right. it's all coming on through for Tessas here. 15 seconds. It would be terrible if he died after the time. He needs to consider that as an option as he pushes forward and he eventually gets taken out. So as you can see there, 2400, that's the best they can muster. We're talking about Mac 10s or Tech 9s. It looks like those plans might falter unless something great comes from this, I guess, fake piece they're trying to sell to be. It's pulling some attention. Oh, uh -oh. No, the bomb has to hide. There it is. It's this is this is gonna come down to oh, the that's, it. It's over. that's it. Yeah, Electronic has single-handedly won on this round as well. Two of them. And poor old Borup, Cadian, just no longer shadows of the former selves, Tech Nines. It's 16 to 14, Navi with the must-win series. Boomage just exhausted after that one. And the fist bump check. Way we got all four. Love to see it. We'll be breaking it down after the break.